outside Pfizer Forum now about 14 hours away from tip off of game six in these NBA finals. You know, athletes and let's be honest, fans, we too are often very superstitious. Lucky socks, jersey you wear for every game. You put the flag out, you don't put the flag out. Pre-game rituals. We think it all matters. And when things are going well, you do not mess with a winning streak. Things have gone well for the Bucks here at home in these playoffs, and they are not going to mess with that streak either. So we are joined this morning by local performing artist Ben Tainai, who is the show before the show, singing the national anthem. And he's done that for every game here at Pfizer Forum in these playoffs. Ben, so good to see you. Can you get us started with just, just a little taste this morning? All right, let's see what I got here. Um, and the Rockets red the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. It's a shame that I have to interrupt that. <laughs> I want you to finish it, but I did want to ask you a question or two. So you've done done the anthem for all the playoffs. When did this become like a we have to have Ben? Like, I mean, you've done it many times, but when did it become like an imperative that you were here? Yeah, well, I think it was the first series. So against Miami, uh, you know, Miami beat us last year in the bubble. So I think everybody was sort of nervous about that series. And the first game that was at Pfizer, we were, it was a really tight game and we ended up winning in overtime and it was sort of like a, everything was going our way at the end right, <laughs> so right, I think right. they, so after that they called me and they said let's let's see if we can get another one and then the next game they won by like 30. so then after that it was like the legend was born <laughs> right. are, are you a little superstitious like that you know I mentioned all those things like all right just it's working just leave right. it yeah I would say I am I in <laughs> fact I always wear the same outfit even if I'm in something like this because I just I am a little superstitious about it Good. so I, I wear the blazer and the pants and I'll change the shirt but other than that I pretty much am the superstitious kind of with that. <laughs> Have you been able to look over at the guys now and then? Do they notice and do you feel like a part of that action before the game? Yeah, yeah. I would say at some point I've met most all of them and they've That's all sweet. been very kind and very uh, like supportive and and you know I've been able to talk to them through this process so it's been it's been just so cool. It's been you're I, I know you because I've seen you perform before yeah. you are a grateful person and I feel that in in some of the things that you've posted and the experience you've had you must be so grateful to be a part of this moment. Yeah I'm very grateful and you know I that's just kind of the way I was raised and I just feel very uh, I feel very blessed to be in this situation and I don't take any of it for granted at all honestly I I know that I'm in a really cool position that a lot of people would like to be in right now yeah. and honestly uh, um, I think I will never forget it, and I will always be grateful for that. Absolutely. We're grateful for you. Good luck Thank tonight, sir. Much. Great Thank to you see you, much. Ben. Good to see you too. All right, we're going to send it back inside to Katie. All right, the good luck charms are all in place, Katie. We've done our part. Thank you. We